Yo, what is up, everybody? We are back with Lords of the Fallen. I'm showing y'all a quick level up glitch. I'm not the finder of this. I found it on DPS. Uh, I don't know who the original finder of it was. It's the same kind of save dupe glitch that's in every like Souls-like game, just like it was in Elden Ring, Dark Souls 3, and all that. So, what we're going to be doing is duplicating uh, the soul consumable items. If you have any souls right now, my recommendation for y'all is to come over to this this guy right here and you'll be able to get everything you need from him um, he sells consumables that are 3200 3, and 1600 um, so once you buy those you can duplicate it you can start from one and keep working your way up uh, you can also duplicate the umbral scowlings and upgrade materials so um, very useful for those of you see that uh, are wanting to play this game and upgrade all the weapons for PvP and stuff like that or even try out different builds so with that being said easiest way to do this you do need a friend I am playing on Xbox I'm gonna show y'all that I am in fact he's not already in my world no items are already dropped I'm not just picking up stuff from a downed enemy he's gonna join my world Hopefully on the first try. Alright, so what Cake's going to do now, since he has the hard save and the items, he's going to drop them. Cake, go ahead and drop them. <coughs> so. Thousand of the Vigor Skull, and those are 32 that's the 3200 we only have the 3200 one because we just wanted the biggest one look he can drop upgrade materials as well as those shards so uh, I will warn y'all now going over a thousand can hurt your game so be very careful with dropping large amounts like that um, with the scouring I would only drop 500 at a time from here what cakes gonna do I'm gonna show y'all he's gonna go press start He's going to go into here. He's going to go into his manage game. He's going to go to his save data. He's going to go to here. And he's going to delete from console. I'm not going to do it because I'm holding the items now. And I want the item. So uh, once he does that, he will reload the game. It'll back up his cloud save. And from there, he can re-summon into my world, drop the items again. And we can keep on going. Um... The easiest way to get a hard save is, uh, let's say Cake loses the item somehow. You know, something stupid happens. Uh, there's a glitch with the, with dropping the items, because that can happen, you know. Um, so what happens is, is I would go to his world, I would drop the items. He would just, I would just leave his game like normal. I would just do a quick go to exit menu. What Cake would do is then come into my world, he would quit the game, I recommend doing it twice just to make sure it actually hard saves because whenever you rage quit in a Souls game, it does a hard save 99% of the time. Uh, you can kill yourself. Killing yourself, we have realized, is not 100% uh, guaranteed to get a hard save. Uh, we have noticed this is the easiest way to get a hard save. So, just to help you all out. So, Cake, I'm going to re-beckon you. I'm assuming you're back in your game. And, and you all will see... A cake will have everything still to give us. And like I said, this is a fantastic way to level up. Uh, I have no problem with using glitches and stuff because I like to try out different weapons. I do plan on doing PvP for this game. And there's no light, there's no level cap for PvP. So you could be level 25 invading a level uh, 200, you know. It's very unfair. So I do recommend using this just to weigh the odds more in your favor. Uh, at the end of my stream, personally, I was level 25. After only an hour of doing this, I went to level 258. Does that ruin my gameplay for my first playthrough? No, I don't feel like it does, but that's just me. So, and I would as and I would assume it's pretty much the same for uh, PlayStation and PC. because all systems have a cloud save, you just gotta figure out how to do it for yourself. So. Um, with that being said, just to prove that I have the items, look at this, 2,000. I'm not going to pop them right now because I don't need these. So, 
okay, quit his save, and he will still have everything. So it's a great way to do it and a great way to level up and to get all the items, not miss anything. So with that being said, I love y'all. I really hope you all enjoy this good, uh, glitch to level up, make the game a little bit easy and more fair in your uh, favor. Peace out. Stay safe.